Hi, I'm Ryan Groom. Hi, I'm Joey James. Perfect. <laughs> The purpose of this experiment was to display how different forces such as collisions and momentum play and affect different objects and how we can create an object that can save an egg from those forces. If we drop our flawlessly crafted container from the bleachers, then the egg will land completely secure because of our perfect implementation of the hexagon, nature's most efficient shape. The hexagon maximizes the spacing within a 25 centimeter area while maintaining a highly protective spherical form, safety from all angles. Not to mention it is a multiple of the triangle, the strongest shape ever. Our container uses straws, duct tape, this foam insulator, along with string. We've also added, a lot of these are broken, but we're, we've added little straw nubs to divert some of the force of impact away from it as yes. you can see a lot of them are broken that's because We've been it works yes and we tested it I think it's, I think it worked. Test number one, successful. Huh? What if I just like chunked it? No, don't do that. Okay. Are we dropping it on the concrete? Yes. <laughs> Be careful, please. I don't know about that one, Chief. Really? I'll inspect. So it turns out the one thing we didn't film was us measuring the weight and the dimensions of the container. So we had to guesstimate a little bit. So we're gonna say the egg was 50 grams. We were able to, to uh, weigh the foam insulator and that turned out to only be 15.3 grams. The straws, we cut about nine straws in half. Straws are really light so that only ended up being about four grams. And the tape, we used pretty much like two-thirds of an entire roll of tape. We ended up with about 20 grams. For a total of about 89.3 grams for our container. I think that was good. I think that was good. I think it's fine. Our hypothesis was correct because our crack successfully contained an egg and prevented it from busting. Our craft worked because it was light, so therefore when it hit the ground the forces were less. Since it was in a hexagonal shape, when it hit the ground it rolled, which made the forces of the, of the impact spread evenly. And the rest of the impact that we couldn't absorb was absorbed by the foam insulator that was holding the egg in place. So the gravity caused our container to fall towards the earth. When it hit the ground, it caused a collision, and the force of the impact was sent in an opposite reaction back into the container. But our container was able to spread out the forces evenly, 
and save the eggs from the forces. Air resistance affected it in a greater way than it affected other people's crafts because ours is light. Our design was successful because of our implementation of the hexagon. Because it's the, just the perfect shape, as I explained before. And also our choice of materials with straws and string and the best foam ever caused it to be the perfect container. Our crafts could have been better. Many of the hex, the two, the three pieces of hexagon we used, they were different sizes. They did not fit perfectly as we intended. So next time we should measure better and make them fit perfectly better. I got a fat 20 waiting for you. Well, if you give us this 100, you know, 25 if you give us this 100. It's waiting for you. Uh, Ask him about it after class, he'll be there. Why are you opening that cabinet? Huh? 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 Egg no break.